caffeine. Uh, this is about my 20th take and it's a lot of caffeine. My tongue's burned. Check. Lighting. Davis, I have no idea what I'm doing with my lighting, so please ignore the shoddy workmanship. Kind of a check. Well, let's do this. Not really sure what to talk about uh, for this week, which is sad because it's only week two. So this is what I've been up to the last two weeks. First thing I did in Austin was go to a happy hour with all of these Austin Stone students leaders. I started volunteering at the Austin Stone about two and a half years ago with the student ministry at the downtown campus, and it has been awesome the entire time I've been here. But one of the things that was just not there was the sense of community with the students leaders like I'd experienced at other ministries I've been a part of, like Camp Allen. Leaders didn't really know each other that well. It was more like a clock in, clock out kind of volunteer thing. It was kind of a bummer. But the Spirit has breathed new life into this community. Um, there's a new group of guy and girl leaders who have come in this past semester and really shaken things up. Shaken? Shaken? And now our sense of community is better than ever. Another really cool thing I've gotten to do through the Austin Stone lately is something called the Worship Collective, where essentially anyone even remotely related to worship came together and worshiped God. So cool just being surrounded by hundreds of brothers and sisters in Christ worshiping God. And I'm looking around and I'm seeing them worship and I'm like, man, these people get it. They understand the gospel. They know what is going on. And I'm just so pumped to go out into the world and, and walk alongside them. I got to do a pub run too earlier last week. If you think it's like a pub crawl, but faster, you're exactly right. We started at the Paramount Theater, which is some historic theater downtown. Um, drank some beer, ran a mile, drank some more beer, ran back, drank some more beer, and then watched Anchorman. Wait, what? Friday night, we went out to a show in which one of our students leaders was playing bass and it was a lot of fun it was like a 90s country's cover band which was cool i knew like two songs really strange seeing everyone i work at a church with at a bar and the band was called all hat no cadillac also before you come to austin make sure to practice your two-step moves because they will come in handy now i'm filming this on a thursday but i'm leaving tomorrow for a student leaders retreat which is going to be really awesome i think we're going to someone's lake house i Lake LBJ. It's just going to be the downtown campus, so it's going to be like me and like 20 other leaders who I've gotten really close with over the last six months, which I'm really pumped about. And I also get to lead worship, which I really love to do. So those have been some of the highlights of my past two weeks. As for New Year's resolutions, I don't have any. I'm a bit cynical when it comes to stuff like that because I see people all around me who commit to doing something for like 365 days in a row, and then they kind of quit after two weeks. So I've never really wanted to be a part of that. And I hope I didn't say that and you have some like really meaningful and heartfelt news resolution. So let me know. Also, Davis, we never got to Skype. And I think that might have been my fault because you tried to Skype me a few times, but I was always unavailable. So let's do that soon. I still don't know if I like Movie Maker and maybe I'll try it on my iPhone next time. But I need you to show me how to work it. Today's Celebrate Life Day. Yay! Which also apparently means it's Hot Sauce Day. So in honor of Hot Sauce Day, I'm going to take some shots of hot sauce. Mmm, hot sauce. I'm going to use my roommate's... Six Flags Hot Shot Glass. Oh gosh. I think I'm regretting this decision. I don't even know what to say right now. I'm about to take a shot of hot sauce. This to you, my brother, and to Hot Sauce Day. Cheers. That was really disgusting. Uh, that's going to wrap up my video this week. I can't wait to see your video next week. Um, I'm going to go now brush my teeth, drink some mouthwash, and try to... Ugh, my throat is burning. Bye, brother. Can't wait to see your video next week. And let's try to Skype. Bye.